It's business as usual for Lawrence in Weybridge. Ooh, wow. And he's received an email that's right up his street. This is actually really quite unusual. It looks like a guitar signed by the whole of Oasis, which is a very, very nice item. And the fact you get both brothers, the fact they haven't killed each other, is actually quite a result as well. So I know a few people would love that. I'd love to get my hands on this. I don't play guitar. I found one of the most talentless people I know. <laughs> The guitar belongs to mum of three, Angela. Angela remarried a year and a half ago and is in the midst of remodelling her new deluxe family home in Brighton. Started the renovation about six weeks ago and uh, we, had to, we had to knock a wall down. And so there's been lots of crashing and banging and noise and dust. Putting in a state-of-the-art kitchen has meant the family has had to decamp to the back of the house. It's cool, it's just like having um, the caravan on water in some ways. We've had to put our uh, combination oven microwave in the bedroom with the coffee machine on top. You know, you've got to eat, so this is what we're doing. It's a bit makeshift, but it works. Hi. Oh, come on in. Come on in, my darling. The boat might be a temporary stopgap, but Angela's keen to crack on with her three-storey renovation and has enlisted the help of close friend and interior designer, Gillian. Oh, it's so lovely in the sunny room, isn't it? OK, I shall show you what I thought. Now, we're doing a slightly five-star hotel look, but in a cosy version. Oh, a little bit of glamour. Me. Is that really me? No, I haven't seen the top floor. With a wish list of high-end fittings, Angela is looking to raise some extra cash. Dying to show you the guitar. I'm dying to see it. And has a master plan to sell some special memorabilia. It's in lovely condition. Oh, wow. Cool, that it? is amazing. <laughs> <gasps> it's signed by the uh, original members of, of Oasis. Oh, it takes you back to your Oasis days, It takes hey? me back to my youth. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sad to see it go, mm. but um, if it can make somebody um, happy, that's good. I think you've made the right decision. Don't I know we'll just end up in the loft again, which would be very sad. Yeah, it would, wouldn't it? What a, wa what a waste, really. There will be people out there that would pay anything to get their hands on such a beautiful guitar with the signatures of um, a band such as Oasis. So I think £10,000 would be a good starting price. Cadbury Dark Milk, now available as rich, creamy desserts. It's a bit grown up. Download a free audiobook with your 30 day trial. Prestige, Joy speaking. Opening a branch in the centre of London's diamond trade has extended Prestige's international clientele. Could you give me a call back this afternoon? Today, Hatton Garden's new manager, Alicia, has the chance to win new business with a... Cash, don't want to sell their goods. Great, come over here and uh, we'll load him up with more lots of 20. In Weybridge, Lawrence has been tasked with assessing a guitar signed by the members of 90s rock band Oasis. Okay, see you later. See you later. And he's enrolled the help of Britpop expert Rob. Hello, Rob, how are you? Hi. Good to see you. How's it doing? I've got the piece upstairs for you. Fantastic. How are you doing? Hi, nice, nice to see you. you too. Let's hope you're all excited about it. Yeah. I know I was when I saw it. Wow, that's nice. That's the Epiphone Supernova. Uh, they called this Pelham Blue. Yeah. But most of the fans refer to it as, like, Man City Blue. The big Man City fans, of course. Yeah. They actually made these in five different colours, and black. And being the rarest, mm. the, this is the most, most common one. Oh, right. And they were about £500 new. Oh, really? I thought they were more expensive, to be quite no, honest with you. No, they're £500. This one's actually got an old guy and had printed on there. Yeah, Does that make just, it anything special? That's just a facsimile. That's just, that's just for it being a signature guitar. Yeah. These are the, the babies that you'd want to sort of look at. And yeah. it's a lovely example, and old Gallagher's there. Yeah. Yeah, and it's really nice condition as well, and the pickup's lovely. Of course, if it was one that Noel had, had, had played, then you're well, 20, 30, 000, you 30,000. It could, up, yeah. OK, brilliant. Well, thanks a lot for your time, Robert. Thanks, Lawrence. Good to see you, mate. Cheers, thank you. I'll just walk you down and make sure we get off the premises. Thank you. <laughs>